right, want to talk to you for just a couple of minutes on this very, very hot Friday afternoon. I am on the job, and uh, as you can see, I'm starting to sweat. It is hot here in northeast Georgia. Anyway, thought I'd do a uh, video uh, of a suburbia or big city survival food, and uh, this plant is actually a wild plant grows wild you can find it in the woods it loves the shade you can find it here and there everywhere but you especially can find it in the yards of the suburbanites and the city slickers it uh, it is the hosta and hostas are a very edible plant uh, you can eat basically everything from the ground up uh, of course, if you're in the suburbs or the city, you need to watch what you eat. People love spraying fertilizers and insecticides on stuff. So, anyway, it's an excellent tasting, excellent tasting wild edible. Now, like I said, this thing is a wild edible. It grows wild. You can find it here and there in the woods or wherever. But uh, most people know it as a uh, ornamental for their yard but it's edible and it's a good one to know if you're a suburbanite or a city slicker hey i am not an expert make sure you consult with a local expert before you go eating anything hostas man there's all sorts all sorts of, of hostas all all they there's a, 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 a big variety of hostas. Anyway, I do believe all of them are, are edible, but make sure that ones you eat, if you're going to eat any, make sure that they're edible. Don't, uh, don't take my word for it. That's it. Man, that looks like a, that looks like a, a broadleaf plantain right there. Somewhat, anyway. Anyway, excellent wild edible, excellent survival food for the suburbanites and the city slickers. We'll see ya.